So I have to do this again. <laughs> and I can answer this pretty briefly and pretty straightforward. What connection does it have to you personally, to your artistic practice, and to a broader cultural social context we are living in? We are living in COVID-19. And in, during this time right now, it is a time where we're extremely isolated. Um, and so coming together in a certain way, especially something that's facilitated, um, it automatically brings something we all need, which is connection. You know what I mean? Uh, and so I'm thinking about this within my own practice as a way of instead of making choreography about self and controlling how people see self making it about revealing self and 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 connecting in that revealing you know what i mean uh so that's what my practice is so what what better way to do that in a mark than you know an outside parade or a way for everyone to parade and share their their colors their hues their their uh being together um what better way to do it than a parade? Um, and what better way in our context in the world we live in now than to do it, uh, than to do, like, you know, than to do it now <laughs> in the summer. So it's a perfect time and it's pride. Um, I think that's one of the things that was very interesting about the time period that I'm planning on doing this is the end of pride. So it may line up around the time of the pride march, which will be a whole nother kind of concept and way of pulling into the 1980s idea um, I'm pulling from the facilitated script stuff and just what does it mean? I think I'm also interested in at this point um, how my practice relates to um, uh, breathing bodies moving together with focused energy. So it's also a march. Um, which I think is also kind of needed at this point in our lives. We need that march, but march with purpose, not march with visual um, expectation, march with purpose together. So, yeah, that's how I think it relates to me personally, my artistic practice, um, and also, you know, social cultural context of where we are. Um, I think it really does tie into my hope of building something around movement philosophy and how to move together.